What's up guys, welcome back to our channel again this is Keith and welcome to Keith's Daily Alright, where we share with you guys some family tips, tricks and ito yung mga cheap buys or yung mga quality pero pasok sa bulsa ng mga gadgets or mga purchases para sa mga smart parents or smart families like us So yun, uh, let's jump right into it and bumili tayo ng uh, Conzer KX450 Plus uh, it's a Shang subwoofer speaker na 2.1 2.1 channel, which means there are two satellite speakers and one subwoofer. I've been hearing good feedback about this. Uh, coming from my Sam brand subwoofer or soundbar review. Maraming mga bas na concert kit for 50. So ito, magkaroon uh, tayo ng opportunity to buy a speaker like this. And uh, syempre gagamitin natin to dito sa ating second floor. Just going back to concert before we unbox this thing. So again, it's made locally which means yung mga service centers na ito eh nagkalat din, right? Meron ding mga ibang authorized dealers uh, such as AAJ Electronics dyan sa Raon, Manila. So shoutouts po sa lahat ng nasa AAJ Manila. Uh, kay Sir Eman, sa kay Ma'am Trans, maraming salamat po sa pag-support Salmon dito. But anyway, sila rin nagsusupport din sila ng parts and warranty uh, service so, yan, for one year. So, sobrang sulit and uh, good deal na rin. Uh, talking about its price point, uh, SRP po na ito is nasa 49999 or may ibang stores na 4499. Hanap na lang kayo, hanap na lang tayo ng authorized dealers uh, where ipasok pa, pa, yung budget nyo to purchase one of these. Talking about the brand, uh, just want to make sure you buy the original uh, from the authorized electronic dealers and stores uh, unfortunately kahit gawang local eh naka class A or na nagkakaroon pa ng imitation uh, yung mga ganitong class A units so just wanna make sure you buy the original uh, do your research and uh, you know look up all the authorized dealers as much as you can alam buksan natin what's in the box Okay, from the get-go, of course, you'll see the accessories plastic bag. Uh, yan, makikita niyo yung user manual. Uh, meron din siyang sariling remote. Alright, it comes with the battery. Dito sa nabila ng electronic store. AAJ Electronic Store sa Raon. Maraming salamat po. Meron siyang uh, RCA, to auxiliary cable, right? So, ito, ito, magiging best friend nyo to sa mga gadgets and appliances or electronics na gagamitin nyo to use and connect to use to connect to the speaker right so it can go to your cell phones like this all right this is an iphone so this is an android phone and then chat yeah di ba? should so yun but this a pc and this a tablet and especially by the way some mga tvs like this and then of course you'll have your warranty card medyo nagulog na gulo na ang kaunti uh, and then sa likod, makikita mo na yung mga service centers with their contact details and information. So, shoot! Ayos! And then, obviously, you'll have your speaker wires. Alright? So, dalawang pares po ito. Alright? Uh, kakabit natin siya mamaya. Uh, one goes to your subwoofer and to your left satellite speaker. And then another one to your subwoofer and then goes to your right satellite or standing speaker. So, madali lang naman siya yung kabit. Color coding lang siya. So, kabit natin siya in a bit. Alright, next is yung ating, ayan, meron din siyang kasamang free, ah, uh, meron siyang kasamang mic. Ayan, so meron, meron tayong libreng mic from concert, so just plug it in, and of course, put yung mic input mo, and then saksak mo lang siya sa harap, and then yun, instant. Pwede ka nang mag-video, okay, or karaoke, okay, this multimedia uh, system, or multimedia speaker system, and we'll discuss that in a bit. Alright, first is yung itong satellite speaker. Alright, medyo mataas siya. It's about, I don't know, maybe 2, two, two feet or close to 3 feet. Ayan. And then another one like this. Alright, there we go. Ito yung satellite speaker niya. And then, of course, buksan din natin yung sabuk. Alright, there you go. Medyo mabigat siya guys. So, daan-daan lang. And be really, really, really careful when holding this thing up. Kasi, syempre, you wanna make sure You'll have this protected and secured back to the kaysa naman malagay. Alright, ito na yung 2.1 channel natin na sinasabi. Two speakers as two, is to one uh, subwoofer type of setup. So, yan. Ito po yung subwoofer natin, mga kaibigan. Uh, let's, talk about, let's talk about its physicality muna, yung actual size niya. No? Like I've mentioned, this is about two uh, and a half feet, if I'm not mistaken. And then this is about 
you know, a feet and a quarter or something like that. So, yeah, medyo mataas din siya. And then, pag-usapan naman natin yung size ng speaker. Yung subwoofer niya, yung speaker size niya is 8 inches. Alright, and then dito sa dalawang satellite speakers natin, eh, yung speaker size niya is 4 inches circumference each. And then yung tweeters niya is 1 inch each. Alright, so yun. Medyo malaki-laki na yun. And I'm sure it can power up, you know, uh, a house or a specific venue uh, to a certain power or to a certain extent where you can really really hear and feel yung lakas po nitong ating Condor KX450+. Plus. Okay, so uh, next is, ito muna yung nasa harap siguro. No? So sa harap, let's talk about what, uh, ano ba yung mga ports na available dito. Uh, you'll have your SD card slot here. So kung meron kang music na nakalagay sa SD card, shoot yan dyan. And then of course, you'll have your USB port. Yes. Pwede ka rin mag-USB play dito. So if you have audio or you have music files on your USB or your flash drive, shoot mo lang yan dyan siya. And then I'm sure, tutugtog na siya ng diretso. A couple of mic ports, dalawang mic inputs, mic 1 and mic 2. Uh, meron na tayong isang mic, so kung gusto nyo dalawa or duet, pwedeng pwede rin. And then nandito yung dalawang knobs for your mic adjustments like mic volume and echo. Pakita ko lang sa inyo mabilisan, ano naman yung nasa ibabaw. A uh, couple of knobs, isa for volume, isa for bass. So yes, may bass control po siya. Pwede nyo tiflahin yung bass uh, levels niya. Uh, to your to your preference and then dalawang buttons uh, next to uh, previous buttons kung naka USB kayo or naka SD card kayo pwede nyo siyang kontrolin dito sa ibabaw and then yung play pause button mo nandito rin and then your input selection button is also on top so yun meron siyang limang inputs guys so of course meron tong bluetooth connectivity yes diba shoot din yung bluetooth connectivity rin meron siyang FM radio tuner and then, yun, yung USB and then yung SD card na pwede mong gamitin and of course yung auxiliary mo if you guys are going to use this cable, yung pinakita ko sa inyo kanina. So, AUX or AUX mode yung gagamitin natin if you guys wanna connect your uh, phones or your tablets na hardware. So, kung gusto nyo i-connect yun, auxiliary po yung pipiliin natin. Alright, and then sa likod, ayan, syempre yung pinakita ko sa inyo kanina yung mga speaker wires dito po yun sure shoot. So, pag again, mag-auxiliary mode tayo, Alright, itong input na to, yung puti at saka yung pula, po yung gagamitin natin. Alright, puti here, pula dito. <laughs> and then ito sa mga appliances or sa mga gadgets nyo na gusto nyo patutugan. Of course, you'll have your power cord. Uh, mukhang mahaba-haba siya. Siguro 1.5 meters to. Okay, and then of course, you'll have your power button here on and off. Awesome, di ba? Okay, mabilisan lang. No? So, yung specs natin, nabanggit ko na. Uh, I think isa sa mga selling point nitong item na to is yung actual power output niya, guys. So, ito, uh, this uh, actually puts up 4,500 watts of uh, power output um, for multimedia playing. No? So, ibig sabihin, malakas yung uh, power. Ibig sabihin, malakas yung circulation ng electricity around the sound and music. And of course, yung base na kaya na yung input. Uh, just a quick comparison, siguro yung kung ano na lang yung meron ako, yung, which is yung same brand, HQ3000 soundbar. Uh, na Bluetooth din, uh, 800 watts lang yun guys. Pero I would say, malakas pa rin si same brand, but I'm really really excited and uh, I can't wait to test this thing kasi nga 4.5 yun. Merong button dito sa remote control, it says EQ. It's somewhere the left in the middle, it says EQ. Uh, meron siyang 5 equalizer inputs. So, paglaroon nyo na lang guys. Um, anyways, meron naman siyang bass control dito sa ibabaw. So, pwede rin siyang maging factor. Pwede rin siyang magplay ng role for how your quality, sound quality would uh, come out. Alright? So, tara. Kabit natin. Here we go. 1, 2, 3. Ayan! So, yan. Nakabit na natin siya guys. So, no? magic. Yeah. Nakabit na yung mga speaker cables natin. Nakapower on na din. So yun, uh, try natin lahat ng inputs, alright? I'll show you guys how it sounds like. And so, higit na siguro natin yung bass and then huwag natin masyadong lakasan yung volume dahil medyo baka mabulahaw yung mga kapitbahe natin. So currently, it's in aux mode. So palitan natin yung input. Uh, let's use the remote. Sa remote, uh, pipilit mo lang yung mode button to change from one input to another. So from AUX. FM radio mode. That's FM radio. Bluetooth connected. Ayan. So next is yung Bluetooth. Ayan. So try natin sa Bluetooth guys. Ha? I'm using my phone right now to connect to the Bluetooth. Ayan. So paired na siya. So 
po tayo ng no copyright sound from YouTube and ito medyo basy naman tong nakita ko kanina na sample so let's see Yun, yun, same reaction yung uh, nangyari sa akin nung natinesting to doon sa Raon, sa AAJ Electronics. Yeah, I was uh, really really surprised on how loud and how bassy and powerful this thing is. Gosh, that. Sorry. <laughs> Ang lakas talaga, man. I mean, I'm not being, ano, okay, or hindi ako nag i pero grabe. Talagang ramdam mo, eh. I mean, again, isa isa natin. Next is, uh, ano yung next? Audio input mode. Audio input, AUX. Okay, balik tayo sa AUX. This time, try natin sa laptop. Okay? Para makita lang natin yung difference. Ayan, drop natin ito. Alright, uh, again, pinangako po yung isa-isa natin, so let's try yung mic input naman. So, teka lang. Ayan, so let's try the mic. <laughs> Ayan, so gumagana naman siya, mga kaibigan. So, nakatodo yung mic, and then medyo pinawasan ka ng kaunting echo. So, yeah, it's working. So, let's try out a few things here. I found love. Oh, tama na. Ayan. <laughs> So yeah, gumagana naman yung mic. Very decent naman yung sound quality niya when it comes to mic. Teka, pita ko na nga ito, ba't ba ako nakamike pa? <laughs> but yeah, uh, yeah, timplahin nyo lang yung tamang settings. Uh, to your preference, like I've said, uh, okay naman yung build ng mic. Um, I think this is a standard mic wire. Alright, there you have it. So kanina narinig nyo yung mga testing-testing natin na music, which is really, really awesome, in my opinion. So... Kanina, uh, hindi nakatodo yung volume noon, hindi rin nakatodo yung bass. Siguro mga 3 fourths or 3 quarters yung uh, bass. May, medyo binabako pa nga ng kaunti kanina. But still, it sounded really really great and it sounded awesome. Siguro sa dial lang, I think uh, dito sa mic tsaka sa echo, okay. Kasi meron siyang horizontal bar like that. So makikita mo kung nasa yung levels niya. But here, sa so volume and sa bass, rounded lang siya or circle lang siya. So I think... Uh, kailangan mo siyang kapain or talagang titimplahin mo siya kasi nga wala siyang indicator both inner and outer so hindi mo siya masyadong mapapansin kung nasa na siya unless of course marinig mo ng uh, total light ayun so again just a nice to have again this is just a nice to have pero wala siyang manual equalizer guys you're just gonna have to browse through different equalizers na naka preset KKX450 plus uh, siguro sa mga medyo high level or mga branded na, na speakers, uh, yung mga imported na speakers meron ganun but KKX 450 plus wala. But nonetheless, again, hindi siya performance affecting guys. And uh, as you can see, I'm really really satisfied sa itsura ko pa lang. And uh, yeah, hope you guys liked it. I mean, if you guys have any questions, again, feel free to comment down below in the description box. And happy to answer them all for you. But anyway, uh, thank you all for watching. Sana nakatulog and uh, yeah, goodbye